Yo guys, what's going on? It's Toby here, or Toby Jizzle, and welcome back to Search for Silverware. Now, it's been ages since I've done one of these videos, but um, I recently got back into playing Xbox a bit more, as you, you lot might have seen. Um, I've been doing a bit more COD, a bit more Minecraft, and um, obviously I've been doing a couple um, in real life stuff, with obviously the clips from Silverstone and also Fort Park, I think it was, yeah. But yeah, so, I've played another month in this um, season. And let me just run you through what happened real quick because there's one game left in the season and we hit 100 points and we won the league. I'm just going to show you the fixtures that took place this month real quick. Um, <clears throat> Alright, so where do we start off? We started off with uh, Colchester. Yeah, nice 2 1 win against Colchester. These two getting on the score sheet and. Um, this, th I think this was the game that earned us promotion, that win against Colchester, it was a massive game for us. Obviously there are rivals as well, so that was a really good win. Now this game was a really important one against Charlton, because like this extended the gap a little bit, I think Sheffield drew their game that week. But um, we went down to 10 men in that game, and we did actually go 3-0 up in the first half, but then, as they do normally, Charlton started to claw their way back. and. Um, we just managed to hold on to the lead with the 10 men, so that was a really good result for us as well. And then this was the really, really disappointing one against Tottenham because we were 2 0 up in the first half. And this is the FA Cup semi final here 2 0 up in the first half. And then uh, Bjornsson got sent off in the second half, and it really all went downhill from there. And they managed to nick it in extra time. So that was like heartbreaking. But, um,. Hey, it wasn't meant to be. And then we had a shock defeat to um, Walsall on the 14th. And I had a go at my team because I hadn't checked the other results. But this was actually the week that um, we won the league because, um, what's it? Charlton managed to score a 90th minute equaliser against um, Sheffield United. So that like clinched the title for us that week. So that was a really good... Um, really good feeling because that's t two trophies this season, my first season, it's not bad. And then after that we had uh, two pretty standard wins, or not standard, one standard win against Bournemouth. To be fair the pundits were saying that we weren't going to do well in that game, I don't know why we've been doing well all season, so I don't know, but Paul Lentz doesn't like me, he's managing Bournemouth and he doesn't seem to like me, but whatever. And um, finally against Sheffield United at home, we smashed them 4-1 after going 1-0 down in the first half. So that was a massive win for us. Nothing special on the goals front. I don't think any amazing goals were scored this um, this month. But uh, yeah, I didn't get any um, manager of the month awards. No goals of the month, no players of the month. So a little bit disappointing on the, that side. But I have been offered a new contract. Two grand a week. I don't know whether to take it or leave it. I'm looking. I think I want to move to another team after just one season with Wickham. Because, I don't know, the board weren't really helpful throughout this whole thing. Like, I asked for a, a new contract earlier and they was like, no. And this was like, already when I had um, won one trophy, I was in the semi-final. And I, was, I had just been um, guaranteed promotion. And they didn't offer me a new contract, even though I asked them for it. So, that was kind of annoying. Weren't really happy with the finances thing, because they didn't help me out too much on that front apart from once where we got a bit of money in so uh, I don't really know if I want to stay if they'll give me this I don't think they'll give me the support if I am um, when we get to the championship so but look that's really nice to hit 100 points I don't think I've ever done that before on a football manager game 100 points 91 goals scored 40 against and there's one game left to go uh, I don't know who that's against who's that against Oldham Oldham who've already been relegated, so who knows, might get a 9-0 win and get 100 goals scored as well. But anyway, thanks for watching guys, um, if you liked it, leave a like, if you didn't, leave a comment saying what I could improve, and also, I don't know if I'm going to take this contract or not, you guys should let me know whether I should or shouldn't in the comment section below, just like, yeah, take the job or no, move on, so I'll make my decision based on your replies, so. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it and um, peace out.